Hi foodies, I made some juicy oven roasted chicken. So let's get into this scrumptious recipe. So I started off with three leg quarters with the backs attached. They were cleaned, skin left on and pat dried. And now I'm adding all purpose seasoning, Creole seasoning, ginger powder and paprika. If you need salt and pepper, definitely add those because it depends on what brand you use in those other seasonings, right? And now for some fresh ingredients, I have minced thyme leaves, I have minced scotch bonnet and minced rosemary. Of course, can't leave out my garlic. So this is some freshly minced garlic and green onions, finely minced. If you want to, guys, just throw all of this into a blender, okay? And then I have some freshly squeezed lemon juice. Also adding melted butter and olive oil. So massage all of this into the chicken. Make sure you rub it underneath the skin as well, okay? And as I said, if you want to puree all of this, you can do that. So look under the skin. See, I made sure I put some of that seasoning under there and let this marinate overnight, ideally. Now the next day, you just want to brush some butter in a baking dish or a baking tray and then lay the chicken in there skin side up. That's all. And make sure you scrape out all the bits from that bowl you marinated the chicken in. Make sure you put it all over. Last minute, I decided to just add some slices of onion underneath. So you could just grab an onion, slice it all up, put it underneath the chicken. It's going to melt into the juices. It's going to flavor the chicken. Everything is going to be scrumptious. So you'll see, guys, I made sure I put all the seasoning on top as well. Don't leave any seasoning in that bowl, okay? I kind of felt like the chicken needed more color. So I sprinkled on more paprika all over and then I brushed on a little olive oil now this is going to go in the oven at 425 degrees fahrenheit for 40 minutes and here we are guys scrumptious roasted chicken let me tell you the onions that are in there they are so tender and they flavored the juices really nicely i love the color on this because we added a little more paprika and what I did, guys, was I turned on the broiler briefly at the end, so that added even more color to the skin. If you don't care about the chicken skin being crispy, you can baste the chicken while you're roasting it, you know, like every 20 minutes or every 15 minutes. But if you want the chicken skin crispy, you can just roast it undisturbed. And all you need to do is just scoop up all the juices and just... Pour them all over the chicken right before you serve it. So remember guys, as for the seasoning, you can puree everything if you want to. When it comes to basting, you can baste it a few times if you want to or bake it undisturbed. And as far as the end, you can turn on the broiler to get more color if you need to. If you have a larger family, all you need to do is just double up on these ingredients that I'm going to leave in the description box below the video. So check those out. And I really hope you enjoy this. It was so delicious, guys. Let me know what you think once you try the recipe out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.